Uh, the Trump administration, as you know, this past week uh, directed the federal government to stop payments of cost-sharing subsidies under Obamacare. The president called it a payoff to the insurance industry. Uh, why do you and your fellow Democrats oppose doing away with that? So this is the equivalent of health care arson. He is literally setting the entire health care system on fire. Um, the fact of the matter of the, is the president is trying to sabotage the American health care system, trying to put a gun to the head of our constituents by taking away their health care or raising their costs. The president's not gutting the Affordable Care Act. If you, if you take the totality of what the president did, I think it actually helps the family. What the president is doing is affecting the ability of vulnerable people to receive health care right now because the funding that is available under the cost sharing reductions is used to subsidize their out of pocket costs. And if they can't afford their deductible, then their insurance is pretty much useless. Congress needs to step in, and I hope that the president will take a look at what we're doing. Is Congress going to do something? Well, I hope that we can get a deal between uh, Senator Alexander and Patty Murray. But I will say this, that uh, the Republicans in Congress have to be responsible. We have a path in the Senate, demo bipartisan path, at least I, I wonder if he even knows what that path is. Because from what he says, it doesn't sound like he has knowledge, knows the facts, bases his decision on evidence. And, and that's a problem.